This is a quick tutorial on selecting keywords and narrowing search results in library databases. First, we will identify our search terms based on our research question. In this example, we'll use the research question, in the NICU, what is the effect of hand washing on infection control compared with hand sanitizers? The keywords in this question are NICU, hand washing, infection control, and hand sanitizers. It is also helpful to brainstorm alternate keywords. Searching similar words will retrieve different results, even if these words are synonyms or different spellings. Now we'll start our search. Instead of entering an entire phrase or question into the search bar, we are going to break our topic into chunks of keywords like the ones we just brainstormed. Let's enter the keywords NICU and hand washing. Even though this topic seems to be fairly broad, this search only retrieved 12 articles. Let's change our search terms to see if we get different results. First, we'll change hand washing to one word instead of two, which is how I found hand washing to appear in most academic articles. Now we have 83 results. Next, we can change the acronym NICU to its full spelling, Neonatal Intensive Care Unit. This increases our number of results to 172. You can see that the exact way we enter our search terms into the database impacts our results. If you have a high number of results in your search, you can add additional keywords to narrow down your search to get more specific articles. For example, we can add another one of our keywords, infection control. Now we have 138 articles. We can then use the filters on the left side to narrow our results further. Because we want the most recent research, we will change our date range to get articles from the last few years. If your assignment requires you to find peer-reviewed scholarly journals, you may filter your results to academic journals. Now we have a list of 16 articles that are specific to our topic from academic journals and published within the last five years. To get other ideas for keywords to search, take a look at the subjects listed under each article. These show the official medical terms which describe the article. You might also look on the left side under subject major headings section, which identifies the most common subjects in your results list. As you are searching, feel free to change your search terms to retrieve different results. This was a quick overview of how to select keywords and narrow search results in the library databases. Librarians are available to assist you with research during all of the library's open hours in person, by email, and by phone. Please don't hesitate to ask us questions.